Just what America wants, more challenges in Gene's territory. Here's Spears. His speed is his weapon, and he tiptoes the sidelines and picks up first down yardage. Tajay Spears. Watch him bounce this. When he gets the outside, he has some serious juice. This was supposed to be up the middle. And the explosion he has to get the corner on Lattimore. Remember, this guy doesn't have an ACL. Maybe that was my problem. <laughs> I have my ACLs. Maybe that's why I wasn't that athletic or explosive. No. From the 27, Tajay Spears maneuvers and slithers through bodies in the middle of the field before Marcus May makes the tackle. You know, I almost wonder, as you see Spears here, Jason, I almost wonder if they're handing the ball to Spears on some of these first downs because the Saints are thinking, okay, Spears is on first and ten, not Henry. They're going to throw it. As we head toward the two-minute warning, play clock down the wall. Tannehill gets it off, gives it to Spears, and Spears slips one tackle, and he's inside the 40-yard. <laughs> they go to Spears. And Spears, boy, he's got 50 feet, doesn't he? Nearly 11 yards. Derwin James makes the tackle. And he's just fearless. But I think back to when I played with Thurman Thomas, who wore a big, huge knee brace. On first down, they pitch it. Spears has blockers. Spears inside Chargers territory. I said he has blockers. He blockers that got out in front. And the thing that the blocker did really well, just run. Just run through the defender. Don't hesitate. Interesting blocking scheme that time. And it sets up a good run for Spears. They brought the rookie. Toss to the rookie out of two lane. Tajay Spears had to cut it back, and he's got space on this saddle field. Tannehill trying to throw a block. A big gainer for the rookie. Bengals bring just four. Spears gets away from Wilson and picks up the first down. Boy, Logan Wilson read that play perfectly, but could not bring down the 5'11". Picks up nine. Well, Zach Taylor talked about it coming out of halftime to Christina Pink. We have got to tackle better. And right there, perfectly played by Wilson all the way up until he misses the tackle. And There's Spears and the rookie out of Tulane with a nice maneuver as he picks up a first down. Tannehill escapes initially, gets it out to Spears. What a play by Tannehill. Feeling the heat, gets it to the rookie. Boy, Buckner was right there. They pick up 14. Buckner comes around the corner, and that's got to be a for sure sack. I think even Tannehill was bracing for the sack. But somehow he has the presence to pull the ball down, protect the football, and then dump it out to pick up the first down. Well, Tennessee's in business, trying to retake the lead. Little end around action. Spears into some open daylight. Spears inside the five, and he's in. Touchdown. Boy, the electricity in this kid's game is something to watch. 19 yards, and Tennessee retakes the lead. And look, this is almost exactly like their first scoring drive last week. It's now 18-13 and see if the Titans can do any more damage. It's Spears. That's a first down run. The running game is starting to click here. Roquan Smith after a gain of 12. Talked about how Spears has become a nice changeup. Ryan Tannehill said the ying to Derrick Henry's yang. and Quick out. Nice game. Nice game by Spears. He's still going. Spears. Down to the five-yard line. Great job weaving his way in and out and in and out. I thought he was going all the way. Wow. Gain of 49. We've seen a lot of big plays, Kurt. A lot of splash plays, a lot of wild plays, turnovers. Lamar did his thing on a third and short in the red zone. You saw him. 
second and ten. Spears finds a seam. Finds first down yardage and more across midfield and hurtling his way. Speed and the ability to get the ball, get it outside. Nice little move. And he's got and great he's contact dangerous. balance, too, you because he's getting a hit. A hit where you think a guy his size would go down, but he runs through a lot of that. Cut back the other way. Spears fighting to the nine yard line. He goes. Rookie out of Tulane. Flag down. Played for Pittsburgh. He also was a teammate of Levis when they were both at Kentucky. Here it is. It gets a hold of it. Officials on top of it again. And Subtle slide in the pocket and getting the ball out quickly after moving. It's a direct snap to Tajay Spears, and he's got some room down the right side, and another Tennessee first down. Spears races for. Well, they go. Usually they have Derrick Henry's the guy catching the ball in those <laughs> situations, but they mentioned Spears and his different skill set. Third and four. Levis to Spears. Sidestep at the 30. What a move by Spears. Still going and brought down at the 46 yard line. The rookie at a two lane scampers for 15. Zion McCullen comes up to make this tackle. It just misses, completely whiffs. You get a block on Delancey. Delaney, it's. Quick pass to Spears, and he's got the first down and more inside the 30 and up to the 26 yard line. Winfield Jr. on the tackle. Confused. Devin White needs to be out here on Tajay Spears. This is a man coverage look. Instead, he just says the LT route. When in doubt, blitz. <laughs> if you mess up, blitz. Here's Spears at the 18. It's one man miss. That was White. And up to the 28 yard line. It'll be third down and two. On third and five. Blake Lockett one. Here's Spears. Across midfield. And he takes Quiddy Pay for a ride with him. Levis screen Spears cuts it to the middle of the field at the five and Spears has enough with four minutes to go we're tied at 25 Spears on first down and Spears picks up a first once again Matt to the edges Derrick Henry is in the locker room being evaluated for a concussion Tajay Spears is in his place and Spears down the sideline Jalen Jones catches up to him. Yeah, this is another duo block. Tajay Spears is very patient, getting to the edges. And he bounces it on Zaire Franklin, one of the more short tacklers for the Indianapolis Colts, but he shows the explosiveness yes. to be able to get out of that cut and get to the sideline quickly. Protection holds up for a while. Levis backpedaling and delivers across the middle. Spears makes a catch and flashes the speed. First down out near midfield. See his pocket presence, calm, calm, goes to leave, and now, uh-oh, I got to get out, backpedal, and just a lofted ball to Spears, and there's a make a guy miss in space. Yeah, I mean, that's that patience. Yeah. That staying in that neutral space that quarterback coach Charles London constantly. Opens rush for Levis has time, and launches down field in the seam. Catch made, ball pops out of the hands of Spears. Brandon Jones knocked it out, but it's spotted at the five-yard line, and the Titans are threatening. To review the call of a completed catch by Spears, Stans took a couple of steps before Jones arrived to knock the football out of bounds at the six-yard line. And the Tennessee Titans, almost two touchdown underdogs, the biggest underdogs by far this weekend of the NFL, a chance to take the lead here in the final minute of the third quarter. Runner's ball. Titans with some up tempo here. Underhand pitch juggled by Spears, who makes the catch and will get near midfield. So it's a first down. Four man rush. It's a screen. Spears gets free and glides down inside the Miami 35. T formation in the backfield. Breaking <laughs> down on the three point stance. I love it. <laughs> The power game with Tajay Spears to pick up the first down. So once again, Tennessee on third and one. And then they shift here. And what they're going to do is bring Derrick Henry there, 
give you a little eye candy. Think we're going to do a little sweep to him and hand it to the small guy. <laughs> Tasha Spears right up the middle. Never guessed. Small guys have power to a go. Looking into the nickel. Here comes the blitz outside for Spears. Oh, he broke free. He's gone. Spears is going to come back in motion on the right side of the screen. And then as the ball snap, he goes back out on the swing. He gets to the outside. The Jaguars are in position to make the tackle. It's just missed tackles. Six in the secondary. Pitch out to Spears. Looking for a block. Dillard delivers. And he goes downfield. Breaks a Cisco tackle. Taken out of bounds on the play by Campbell. That kid, when he gets the ball, is electric. Jacksonville territory at the 29. It's going to be Dillard who leads this play. Watch out. He gets around to the outside. It's sealed by the receivers. He gets to the corner. A corner is nightmare. It's seeing a big guy like that running up the field, getting ready to block you. But Dillard with an excellent job there out in space. Tannehill, Spears, knifing, spinning, turning. Touchdown! His second today. We got some time until halftime, but I can tell you right now what the message is going to be to the Jacksonville defense. You've got to shore up your tackling. Too many missed tackles and missed opportunities.